uh, vertical launching system. Uh, we have two of these on board. Uh, this, was, this is the smaller of our two. Uh, this one right here we can carry uh, 32 missiles in it. The one that we have on the uh, back part of the ship carries 64. It gives us a total of uh, 96 missiles we can carry at any given time. The type of missiles that we do carry, uh, we carry standard missiles, uh, which are used for uh, self-defense of the ship. Uh, we can use those against uh, air threats and also surface threats. And then we also can carry tomahawks, which uh, are our offensive weapons. And we use those for extended range for uh, land attack uh, missions. And we can also carry VLAs, which are vertical launch as rocks, which are basically uh, they're like torpedoes with a booster rocket attached to them. And we use those for self defense against the submarines uh, trying to attack the ship. Um, the range of our uh, missiles can vary. Um, some can go up to uh, 17 nautical miles. We have others that can go up to 80 or 120 nautical miles. And we have some that can go beyond that up to uh, hundreds of miles. Um, it just all depend on our task and what we're told to do. Uh, it will tell us what type of missiles that we need to use. Um, and uh, that's pretty much it. Um, does anybody have any questions on VLS? What's a nautical mile? Uh, it's just a, a term, a Navy term that we use. Nautical like term in that terms we use. Of like, it's like, like my, mile? Mileage is, it's, uh, like 80 nautical miles, probably roughly between like 82 and 85 miles. Uh, roughly so it's almost, almost one to one? It's almost. This is pretty close. Okay. close. It's like 1.2 to 1 or something okay. like that. Yeah, that this one. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yes. Um, got a head officer back here. Do you want Wiley? Uh, we're, let's see, if I can explain it. I control one of the systems that shoots the uh, five-inch guns behind me. This is our five-inch gun. It shoots a five-inch projectile, which is about yay big around, about that tall, and weighs anywhere from 75 to 80 pounds per projectile. And it works just like a regular gun, it's just a big bull. It shoots 16 to 20 rounds per minute. Per minute. So it shoots pretty quick, too. We use it for a lot of things. We use it for anti-aircraft fire. We use it for small boats. We use it for supporting the Marines on the beach. Uh, they have a tank or something that comes at them. We can take it out from the city. Um, uh, it uh, shoots off a lot of things. We can use lots and lots of things to shoot it with. We can use radars, which our two air search radars are up here on the top. You can see the big panels right here. Uh, we use our surface search radars, which are the two T's up there. Those are our surface search radars. Um, or we can actually use with like Latin logs or visual. We can shoot visually with a thing called optical sight. Optical sight lets us see up to 15 miles, which is as far as gun shoots. And pretty much we can tell where it's going to hit by where we can see it. If we can adjust left or right. We can see the tank is going to be sitting there. We can see whatever we want to see. Um, another thing we can do is we can talk digitally with the Marines on the beach. Pretty much, a laser range find something, say kill this, it comes to us, computers, and we shoot it. Nice and easy, really quick, really easy. Yeah, exactly. You guided? Uh, we have guided. Uh, how it works, we have this room right here, it's pretty much full of hydraulics. Really nothing much in there, just a whole bunch of little gears. And no one really knows what that is. Down below, we have uh, we get what's called a drum loader room. Even farther down, all the way down to the very bottom of the ship, we have a projectile room. What happens is they, uh, down in the projectile room, we have a group of people. They take the projectile that we want, put it in the tube, and shoots it up to the drum loader room. Pretty much acts like a big Tommy gun. It just rotates as it's shooting, as long as it's shoot past. Um, hold 20 rounds in the drum loader room. Uh, anyone have any questions? What are the rounded, is that radar used to the round? No, actually that is uh, pretty much how we get internet on our way. We actually have internet on our way. We have what's oh, called really? SHF and EHF. Uh, SHF is the one on the, our left. EHF is the one on the right. 
it's so pretty satellite much yeah communication satellite okay. communications pretty much okay. Okay, any other questions how much is a round of a five inch Ugh, a lot <laughs> i actually don't know um we, they actually make training rounds for us this is usually what we shoot most out of and the training rounds are pretty much concrete so they're full of sand they have a big brass ring on it really cheap really easy to make they make a lot of them we shoot a lot of them. So uh, they are very bright. Uh, everybody on board is a very, very bright individual. So they, they know how to fix things. Uh, I, I just stay hands off. <laughs> it's it's always been that way. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you, you know it. Anyone else have any questions? I, I was I was on the. Uh, DDG-99, the Bainbridge. Yes, okay. Uh, I was on a Tiger cruise last year or so. And uh, the CEO was, uh, you know, we hit it off right. The guy is a golf nut, so, so am I. So I took him around while the ship was here. That's why he invited me. And then he says, would you like to qualify as a service warfare officer again? And I said, sure, why not? What do you got? He gave me a book like this, and uh -huh. I disappeared. I went to talk to all the chiefs, because they know all the stuff. <laughs> <laughs> now, when does a strike officer, you're in charge of, like, weapons? Oh, you Are want you me? Taking a movie? Just, just, just hold you want on, your don't glasses you back? I want to get one together. You want your? Oh, sure. Okay. Now you say one, two, three, and I'll say two. One, two, three. There we go. Thank you. Thank you so much. My gosh, you're even photographers. Showing the ship's heading and the relative winds, but it gives you different atmospheres and different screens that you put on. This is great. This is our bridge master expert, which is just a commercial radar that we bought off the shelf. Uh, does, does that do like a, a round or does uh, it also do depth? Yeah. No, it just does uh, surface. We have a, uh, our actual a whole sonar sleep on. Uh, I'm not sure if the two of those do that. This is our surface picture here. The one right there behind you is, that's the military spec one. It's actually a military radar. Oh. This one was a, it's a commercial radar. Other ships can have that, the emergency ship or whatever. Put a box here, the man overboard. Uh, 
ship control console. Not like the old engine on the telegraph. Is that like the wheel that used to be in the movies where they... You know, he can actually steer the ship from here to the touch screen. Okay, so what's town and then lean town? Lean town is for... 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 L